Hey, my name is Connor, and welcome to Crypto Empire, where we dominate the crypto markets. In this video, I'll be showing all active Cosmos ecosystem participants how to see if they are eligible for all of the recent airdrops in the Cosmos ecosystem, as well as how to claim them. And if you are not active in the Cosmos ecosystem, don't fret, because there's a lot of upcoming airdrops that have yet to be snapshotted, and I'll be sharing with you the top ones in this video. So if that does interest you, be sure to stick with me until the very end. And if you are new to Crypto Empire, go ahead right now and smash that subscribe button down below and turn on all the notifications so you don't miss any future videos. And let the gains be with you. So as I mentioned in the intro to this video, these airdrops are mainly for Cosmos Atom ecosystem participants. And if you've been subscribed to Crypto Empire throughout 2021, you would have seen my Cosmos staking tutorial that I released on September 20th. And then you would have also have seen my Osmosis full decentralized exchange tutorial that I did release on September 24th. Now, if you were following along Crypto Empire back then and you did take action and stake your Atom, use Osmosis, provide liquidity, and then take those liquidity provider rewards and stake your Osmosis to compound it, you are eligible for most of these airdrops. And now Terra Luna is an IBC chain, inter-blockchain communication chain. So I also did release my Luna staking tutorial back in July of 2021. Look at the Luna price back then, $5.99 by the way. Anyway, I did release this back in July and a few of these airdrops are actually eligible for Terra Luna stakers as well. But like I said in the intro to the video as well, if you did not follow along, don't fret because there are some upcoming opportunities. There are timestamps in the description below. For now, let's get into the most recent airdrops for Cosmos Atom ecosystem participants. So the first one actually came out today and that is Stargaze and the token is STARS. Okay, it's currently trading for 36 cents. Now we can head on over to the Stargaze website and this is an NFT platform. You can see by their Twitter, this is a community owned interchain NFT marketplace. So the platform is not out yet, but if you were staking your Atom, staking your Osmosis, providing liquidity on Osmosis, or you delegated your Atom to the Stargaze node, right? You staked your Atom through Stargaze, you delegated to them as the validator, then you would be eligible for the airdrop. So to check your eligibility and to claim your airdrop, all links will be left in the description down below. There's going to be a lot of links down there, but I'll put the stargaze.zone link in the description. All you need to do is hit airdrop checker, and then if you are eligible, you can claim the airdrop right here. It is very simple to do, okay? And this was a pretty healthy airdrop, not going to lie. Now, moving on, the second airdrop is going to be Comdex. Now, at this current moment in time, Comdex is trading for $5.26. This airdrop has been claimable for a while, but if you haven't claimed it, you still are eligible to claim it. And what Comdex is, it's a decentralized synthetics exchange. Okay, so now to claim this airdrop, I will leave this article leaving you instructions on how to claim your airdrop. It's basically very simple. All you're going to have to do is go to airdrop.comdex.1 and then they leave the steps right here. It's not too complicated. You input your wallet, you check off the disclaimer, you connect it with your Kepler wallet, and you pretty much get your tokens. And to get this airdrop, it was very simple. All you had to do was hold and stake Luna, Cosmos Atom, Osmosis, or XP. RT persistence. Okay, so Comdex, go ahead and claim that one if you have not already claimed it. Now moving on, the third airdrop that already came out, you can claim it if you haven't claimed yet, is Chihuahua. And Chihuahua, as we can see, is a useless meme coin on Cosmos. And Chihuahua right now, ticker symbol is HUA, HUA, is trading for 0 0.0077 cents. Now in order to claim this airdrop, Basically, all you have to do, it's already in your wallet, but you can come on over here to OmniFlix and you can connect your Kepler wallet in the top right and you'll be able to see how many tokens that you actually got from this airdrop, all right? So if you were staking your Atom using Osmosis, staking your Osmosis, come on over here to OmniFlix. The link is in the description below. Connect your wallet and get yourself your, I don't even know how to say it, Hua Hua tokens from Chihuahua Chain and then depending on how much you were staking, etc. This also at the time was a pretty healthy airdrop as well. So now moving on, we also have Desmos and Desmos is decentralized social media on Cosmos. And for this one, if you had followed along and actually staked your Luna before September 30th, before Columbus five went live, you would have gotten this. And then if you were staking any of these listed coins here, mainly Adam, Osmo, 
maybe you were staking a cash or band Stiero Juno, right? If you were staking any of these, these are the snapshot dates. I'll leave the link down in the description below. Right now, at this moment in time, the Desmos token is trading for one dollar and fourteen cents taking a bit of a hit today. Now, in order to actually go ahead and claim this airdrop from this decentralized social media project built on Cosmos, you're first gonna need to see if you're eligible, right? So you can go to go-find.me. I'll leave this link down in the description below. Um, but this is my iced out Lunable, clearly, and we also have my nice social media profile. So if your wallets were eligible for the airdrop, either you staked Luna, Adam, Osmosis, or any of the other listed coins, after you make your social media profile, you're gonna get a grant. Your grant is basically a little bit of DSM tokens that will pay for the transaction, allowing you to claim the airdrop. And then you're gonna to wanna to make the X.4 bowl wallet. I'll leave again this link in the description below. And all you have to do is hit this banner at the top where it says, DSM airdrop announced, claim the airdrop. The instructions are also right here in this article. Again, all links will be in the description down below. It's not too complicated to claim this airdrop. Make sure you do so before they make it ineligible to claim these airdrops. Moving on, our next airdrop is Shade. So Shade is an array of connected privacy preserving DeFi applications built on Secret. Now in order to see if you were eligible for the airdrop on Shade, all you have to do is come on over here to the website and check the airdrop, all right? I was eligible, so if you followed along, you should be eligible as well. Now moving on, so you can see the airdrop calculator as well. I'll leave this link in the description below showing you how much you would have got for how much you staked, etc. And then this is the airdrop.shade.protocol.io. This is where you actually go ahead and collect your airdrop. Now moving on, the next airdrop that you can go ahead and claim already is LUM Network. And you can see right here, what is LUM Network? LUM Network is the first decentralized protocol for business to build authentic trust with their customers. At this moment in time, LUM is trading for basically just under two cents, about 1.9 cents. And this is how you go ahead and claim your airdrop, this Medium article here. But this is for stakers of Atom and Osmosis as well as Osmo liquidity providers. So if you follow along, you're going to be eligible for this one. All you need to do is go to airdrop.lum.network, plug in your Kepler wallet address, and then you can come on over here to wallet.lum.network. Again, all links will be in the description down below. And you'll be able to actually go ahead and claim that airdrop. I got another one for you now. This one is from Bitsong. This wasn't the biggest airdrop by any means, but it's still free money. So Bitsong and the BTSG token is basically a social token that allows, as you can see, artists and fans to build a closer relationship with each other, completely decentralized built with Cosmos on the Cosmos SDK. And here is your Medium article about how to go ahead and claim it. It was pretty simple to claim, and you can see that from Cosmos, there was 96,824 eligible addresses. From Osmosis users, there was 17,381 users' addresses that can claim this one. And the snapshot was taken on December 16th. And then for Juno, the snapshot was taken again on December 16th. And there was 6,659 people. And in total, they airdropped 10 million BTSG tokens. Now, it's important to note, all the instructions are here on how to claim your tokens. But it's important to note, you're going to have to use the bridge over here on the Bitsong website after you claim your airdrop because the, the Bitsong tokens are actually in your Bitsong Kepler wallet address. Because remember, Osmosis or Cosmos is all different blockchains. So you need to switch between them with your Kepler wallet. So first thing you're going to have to do after you claim your Bitsong is actually go ahead and transfer it from Bitsong to Osmosis or the Atom Cosmos Hub, whatever you want. And then you'll be able to have it on Osmosis where you can sell it or provide liquidity, whatever you want to do. But just be aware of that. You're going to have to bridge the tokens first before you can actually get access to them. And before I move on from Bitsong, I will say in order to be eligible for this airdrop, you had to have been staking at least five Cosmos Atom coins, at least 20 Osmo, or at least 10 Juno at the time of the snapshot, and then you would be eligible for the airdrop. Like I said, it wasn't the biggest one. Now, these are all of the ones that have already played out, right? You can claim these now, free money, everybody's happy, yay. It was a pretty substantial amount of money, I'm I'll be very honest with you. It was a very nice gift from the Cosmos developers over there. Now let's get into airdrops that are yet to happen, 
First, let's start with one where the snapshot has already been taken. This is a highly anticipated project on Cosmos, and this is EVMOS. EVMOS is the Ethereum virtual machine smart contract platform on Cosmos, connecting Ethereum to the entire Cosmos IBC ecosystem. This is going to be huge. So this, as you can see, this Atom Osmo ETH airdrop is better than a stimulus check. They're giving away 40% of the total supply of tokens to people that have been using Atom Osmosis or even Ethereum decentralized applications throughout the previous 2020, 2021. Okay, so you can see right here, this is called a rec drop, and this is going to be novel because it's implementing the gas drop mechanism by Sunny. Sunny is the creator of Osmosis, if you didn't know. And the most number of chains and applications involved in an airdrop ever, airdropping to bridge users. So if you were just bridging your tokens from Ethereum to say Polygon Matic or Harmony One, whatever, if you were bridging your Ethereum Avalanche to another network, you're also gonna be eligible for this EVMOS airdrop. And then reparations for users and exploits and negative market externalities. As you guys recall, if you've been subscribed for a while, Mark Cuban invested in something called Iron Finance a few months back. And it turned out to be a total bank run flop. Everybody lost all their money. Mark Cuban lost a lot of reputation for recommending this project all over the mainstream media. Nonetheless, they're going to actually be airdropping EVM most tokens to people that got hit by these exploits and negative market externalities. So got wrecked. Getting wrecked is a part of a healthy market, right? EVM most. So rec drop eligibility, we can go ahead and read right here. First of all, Cosmos Hub users. So if you voted for Adam Governance Proposition 44, you're going to be eligible for, EV, for the EVMOS airdrop. Or if you have been staking your Cosmos Atom, you'll also be eligible. But keep in mind, those delegated to centralized exchange validators will not be included in the snapshot. Okay, and also make sure you're not delegating to a 0% commission validator, all right? Make sure you're delegating to a validator that's charging 3%, 5%, whatever, right? Not 0%. Then Osmosis users as well will be eligible. So if you were delegating to the Osmo validator, well, then you'll be good to go. If you were staking your Osmo, basically, if you were providing liquidity to any of these pools, whether that is Osmo Atom, Osmo Acash, Atom Acash, Osmo UST, Ion holders, and IBC token transfers, right? So if you were just on osmosis and you switch some atom from the cosmos hub to the osmosis chain that's also going to make you eligible for their drop as well and then the ethereum users as well the ethereum gas drop so if you use any of these decentralized applications on ethereum ave uni sushi compound curve i'll leave this article in the description down below i don't have to go ahead and read all these i think you guys might be capable but i'll leave the link down in the description below to confirm if you use any of these you will be eligible again for the airdrop and then the EVM bridges. If you use the wormhole, the polygon bridge, the avalanche bridge, XDI Arbitrum, any of these bridges, again, you're going to be getting tokens, all right? So this is gonna be epic. This is gonna be, I'm expecting a, a very healthy sum from, from this airdrop. It's highly anticipated among the community. So get ready. It's gonna be happening any day now. They did just release the tokenomics. Like I said, 40% of tokens are gonna to be going to the community for this airdrop. And then also the rug. So if you got wrecked by any of these exploits, EIP-1559, Thorchain, Poly Network, Iron Finance, like I said, Pickle Finance got hacked. If you got hit by any of these, you're also going to be eligible for more tokens in the airdrop. And then we can go ahead and read right here, early individual contributors. So EVMOS has been a huge team effort that goes far beyond the resources of the Theracis team. These contributors have doubled down on working on core things for the ecosystem, but we felt they deserve more for their valuable work. The list includes teams that work on upstream dependencies such as Cosmos SDK, Tendermint, and IBC Core, early contributors to the Ethermint library, Orgy Tech, and many individuals along the way who have made a significant impact to our project. So this is definitely very exciting if you were active in the Cosmos or Ethereum ecosystems. You're going to be getting a pretty nice airdrop any day now, so look out for the EVMOS airdrop. It's going to be huge. Now we have another one coming up and you will still have a chance to go ahead and actually get this one. And this is going to be by Passage and Strange Clan. So Passage is a game developer and they are making a play to earn metaverse game on Cosmos built with the Acash cloud computing network called Strange Clan. Right, I actually did mint one of these NFT characters back in 2021 in the fall. So let me go ahead and read right here for you. What are the perks of owning this NFT? 
Will the passage token airdrop? So the wallet owner of the NFTs of the original 5,000 will be granted two allocations for airdrops of the passage token. Keep in mind, don't worry. I know you're probably thinking, Connor, the mint already happened. There's going to be two mints. One mint happened already, the first 5,000. The next 5,000 mint will be happening pretty soon. So we can see right here in this article, the NFT holders of town two will be granted one allocation for the airdrop. And the passage token will be the overarching token for the entire passage metaverse, right? So this is going to be a big one. And I'm looking forward to the strange clan. I already got my frog ready to go, ready to battle some people in the metaverse, do what you gotta do. And I'm going to try to mint the second one, the second mint as well. Of course, I'll be letting all Crypto Empire subscribers, community members, and all of my channels know when that mint does drop. So if you're not in the free Telegram, join the free Telegram. If you're interested in joining the Discord, join the Discord for even more alpha when it comes to all of these NFT drops. We have been killing it recently with NFTs. Definitely follow them on Twitter. Join their Discord, get involved in this community because this is going to be another opportunity. It's, you're still going to be eligible for this airdrop, so get ready for this one. Now, one more before I go ahead and wrap this video up, I know I've covered a lot, is a project not built on Cosmos, but it's built on Terra, the Terra Luna network, and I've been covering it a lot, and that's Levana. Okay, and they did announce, I had a live stream with the Levana team last week, and they did announce that... There will be an airdrop for the Levana token if you were active in the community. And they did say how it's not going to favor whales. So even if you were just, you know, if you didn't even take part in the meteor shower fair mint for the Levana NFTs, you can just go to the secondary, get yourself a dragon egg nested and a talisman, maybe a little bit of meteor dust, join their Discord, get involved in the community. You're still going to be eligible for the airdrop for Levana. This is a very highly anticipated DeFi play to earn game, very similar to DeFi Kingdom's Jewel on Harmony 1 that's taken off. I think Levana is going to be bigger than that, by the way. Nonetheless, token airdrop, you're still eligible. So get involved in the community now and then reap the rewards later. This is a lot of free money on the table. It's been awesome. All of the airdrops I covered earlier in the video were absolutely awesome. We got more coming up. So get involved. Don't feel like you missed out. There's plenty of opportunities right around the corner. So in this video, I covered the Cosmos Atom airdrops for active Cosmos Atom ecosystem participants. Whether you were staking your Atom, your Osmo, or providing liquidity on Osmosis, you just got a lot of free money. If you haven't claimed it already, go ahead and claim it. If you missed out on these airdrops, make sure you paid attention to the end of the video where I covered some projects that will be having an airdrop within the Cosmos overall ecosystem, as well as on Terra, but Terra is built with the Cosmos SDK. If you did enjoy this video, if you learned something new, make sure you let me know by leaving a like and a comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed to Crypto Empire, go ahead right now and smash that subscribe button down below and turn on all bell notifications so you don't miss any future videos. And my name is Connor from Crypto Empire, and I will see you in the next video.